see my decoys out here. I got some decoys out here. Out front. You can see them. Got some decoys out there. I haven't hunted this bird with a decoy yet. So it'll be something different for them. Y'all stand by.
sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh. Man, God is good, boy. God is good. Damn, I hunted, I hunted hard for these birds, boy. I guess the old Jake D. Cordier work. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh man. That was crazy. <laughs> oh man. A14. Last day turkey hunting. <sighs> All right, guys. Got my bird. Nice long beard. Check him out. And check these spurs out, y'all. Y'all see them spurs? <sighs> y'all see them spurs? God told me that, man. <laughs> <sighs> Nice full fan. I had to put a known on the wall. Man. Hunting these birds, I've been hunting hard every chance I could get. And Every single day, something would happen. They come 70, 80 yards, hang up. 70, 80 yards, hang up. See them coming. They won't come. They won't come across the crest of the hill. Had them in the woods. They they stay on top of the hill. They went too far to shoot. I guess persistence and patience pays off. And I just wanted to get my setup a little different here. I got a Jake decoy out here with a Jake fan that I killed a long time ago. And this hand, as you can see, I got an arrow. I couldn't find my, <laughs> I couldn't find my, uh, my stand for it. So I went on, <laughs> went in my uh, arrow, my um, my bow box and got an arrow out of it and just used the arrow. They came right into it. <laughs> I couldn't take it no more. I, I don't know. I guess with so many things messing up, I didn't. I just didn't want to blow the hunt. And um, I probably should have let them beat on the decoy a little bit. Um, but. Other than that, man, I'm proud. I mean, probably be the only bird I get this year because today is technically my last day of turkey hunting uh, for this spring. So, so God be the glory. God be the glory, man. I can't, I can't say no, I can't say no more, can't say no less. But here's the bird. Like I said, nice long beard, and I get it measured, get it measured out, and everything when I get back to the house. <clears throat> But um, God is good, man. Catch y'all back at the house. <clears throat> All right, back in the crib. Take the measurements on the bed. I'm looking at about right there at 11. Right there at 11. The longest one is right there on the left. Seven inch beard and looking at. Shoot, what's that? Almost an inch and a half, inch and a half spur. Good morning. Let's see, let's get a weight on. That's what we need. We need pounds.
19.31. Nice heavy bird. But guys, this is my only bird for the season. I got some things I need to take care of, such as life. But I just want to say thank God for this opportunity and be able to go out today and harvest a nice big bird. And I just want to say thank you to Aaron. Holler at A&A. &A. Get your stuff straight for deer season next year with your dogs and your hounds. I have his information in the, um, in the video somewhere. So, as always, like, comment, subscribe. Y'all stay tuned. Thank you.